Kerala Transport Minister Anthony Raju on Monday said that the government will impose hefty penalties on tourist buses and their operators if illegal fittings are found on the vehicles. Starting Tuesday, strict action will be taken against tourist buses violating the law. If any violations are found, the fitness certificate of the bus will be suspended. The driver's license will also be cancelled. Also, there will be strict monitoring of excursions. A decision in this regard was taken in a high-level meeting of the transport department. The development comes just days after a tragic accident in Palakkad where a tourist bus found to have driven recklessly and over the speed limit collided with a KSRTC passenger vehicle killing nine. In the case of the Vadakanjeri accident, it was also found that the speed governor which limits the speed of a vehicle was detached. In the wake of the Vadakanjeri accident, the motor vehicle department is conducting a statewide vehicle inspection. The transport department has decided to enforce a white color code on the buses. Contract vehicles should be painted white with blue borders. The minister urged all such vehicles to switch to this paint as soon as possible. Colors other than white will be banned. Meanwhile, Transport Minister Anthony Raju responded that the cause of the accident in Vadakanjeri was the excessive speed of the tourist bus and the negligence of the driver. He added that a criminal case will be filed against those who remove the speed governor system of the vehicles and a fine of Rs 10,000 will be imposed for illegal alterations. The new changes are to enforce strict adherence to the law, the minister said. The Kerala High Court too had made a directive on similar lines. It urged for the cancellation of fitness certificates of modified vehicles. The government welcomed the court's order and said it will be strictly implemented. A super check cell has also been formed to carry out surprise inspections. If the vehicle is found plying on the road with modifications, all officers involved will be penalized, the minister said. Apart from vehicle checks, there would be random inspections jointly by RTO officials and excise department to catch those driving under the influence of intoxicating substances, the minister added. GPS has also been made mandatory in vehicles. The fitness certificates of vehicles without a GPS will be cancelled, the minister said. News desk, Comedy Global.